All right, not a pretty angle here. <laughs> Angel. There you go. Much better. Good morning, neighborhood community. Good morning. <laughs> Good morning. Yes. Kayla. Kayla's here. Blue car lady. Here comes. AKA. Trouble. Oh, no boombox. Huh? I'm going to bite your ear as you bite my nose. So, today, what are you doing? What are you doing? Well, considering the fact that I was up till four something coloring with Carla, <laughs> believe it or not, Carla and I will sit on the phone coloring together. I know, we're weird. But well, FaceTime, so it's kind of like you're there. Yeah. Yeah. Just just having them like on the phone. Yeah. It's FaceTime, so like you can just like look over and be like, oh, there's their beautiful face. Yeah. Okay. So I know guys just don't understand. Yeah. FaceTime is the best invention ever. Yeah, and she <coughs> was awake, so. And you play. stayed up, so you're going to sleep all day today. Yeah, that's I'm what take, you're planning on I'm doing. I'm going to take a nap. That's and that's what that was getting at. I, I was going to take a nap. I know, it's just really taking a while to get there. <laughs> so, and I am going to go in the backyard and uh, attack that palm tree around. And pipe. Try to save the pipe from the palm tree. <laughs> Val says, oh, you're just going to cut the pipe out? I didn't say it like that. Yes, you said you were going to cut the palm tree, and I said, and the pipe. All right. <laughs> so, that's what's going on today. <laughs> say goodbye. Look, look at Boomer. Bye. Mm, Boomer's mad because I won't let him bite my nose. <laughs> All right, so here I am back at my uh, faucet. Um, it just looks like dirt around it right now, but it was actually a giant uh, root ball from that the palm tree growing all around it. I need to clear it. I have the, the cutoff switch over here which I had uh, Mike Dunn put in for me when uh, I was having issues with this before. And it gives you an idea of the size of the root ball. This is uh, part of the root ball out here. It's just a big round section. It's all root ball. Now I'm hoping to cut as much away from my sprinkler systems as possible uh, and uh, I don't think uh, palm trees grow back from a root so let's see how this works out. Okay so I dug enough around this pipe that I could uh, fix the pipe. I have not been able to remove all the ball because it's huge. All right, so I just have to make a run to Home Depot today. Um, I don't have the uh, PVC glue. Uh, what I had dried out, I haven't uh, done this kind of stuff in a long time. So I need to pick it up regardless because I'll probably be end up doing this kind of work future and um, the hose wouldn't come off of the faucet and uh, nothing I did will get that the hose to come off and I don't know why it's done that I, it may have been damaged by the tree it wasn't damaged by me I can tell you that it would not come off so I have to replace the faucet and I have to replace the um, head of the hose because I have to cut it all off just to get it working. Okay, so here is my solution. I have the pipe sticking out. I got plenty of pipe to, to work with. I cut it already. I basically, um, I use this cutting tool. Faucet here refuses to come off the hose. So the hose is done. I'm gonna have to cut the hose. And I bought a repair kit for the hose. So I have that. I had to buy a replacement for the faucet. And I have the connection. Plus I also bought some uh, glue and primer. I also realized that there was a cut 
in the sprinkler line and so I got a compression fit to, uh, to fix that so all in all putting this all together cost me about 23 bucks so here we go okay so I need to prep the pipe I want to make sure there's no burrs on the edge that's going to stop it from going on I'm going to use a little sandpaper it's only it's like 400 grit so it's not going to take a lot off but it'll clean the pipe with all the mucky muck and I've got one of these things to make sure it's not burned on the inside it's nice and dry so So I've got my new uh, fitting that goes onto the pipe, and I've got my new faucet. This probably costs more than uh, everything else. And I am going to put this on here first, so I'm not trying to twist it onto a plastic pipe and over, over tighten it and break it. I'm going to use some Teflon tape, which I probably don't need, but uh, that's just how I am. Better safe than sorry. There we go. I'm going to leave it open so I can get it air to dry. And uh, first, you want to put on the, the primer, which is the purple stuff. So, the purple stuff is a primer, it will actually soften the plastic. And it will also activate the glue. Put them on both sides. Put it together. Give it a quarter turn. And then we just wait for it to dry. Okay, so now I'm going to fix the hose. on put that in all right so there's that so I also have this um, drip line that got cut somehow and so I will cut this out and fix it I want to make a nice clean cut, so I'm going to cut this completely out. So, I don't know if you saw any of that because I knocked the camera over, but I just push it in. It's a 90 cent pressure fitting. I will test the water right now. It should be dry. And we'll see how that works out. I'm going to uh, put my new hose attachment on. Because I don't want to soak everything over here. And I'm going to take my hose, the other end of my hose, put it over the fence because there's where my, my switch is. And I will see how well this works. Okay, so I'm on the other side of the fence and I'll be able to see if all this is going to hold water. I'm going to come over here and turn it on. Jeez. All right. I see no leaks. All right, so turned it off and there's no leaks. I'm all good. And uh, I just got to clean all this stuff up. And I am done for today.
All right, there we go. Hose working. Uh, no palm tree growing out of the middle. You can hardly tell that uh, anything happened over there. So, and that's just the beginning of stuff that I have to deal with in this backyard. Because it is a mess. I got a baby pumpkin. And I took a nap with it. <laughs> Angel wants it. Uh, you want to taste? You want to smell? No. Nope. You want to smell? No. Nope. You want to smell freckles? <laughs> yeah, I licked it. That's my baby pumpkin. Oh, my big boy. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> I didn't sleep last night because I was up all night coloring. And Kevin went to the store and he came home and he handed me a baby pumpkin and I, apparently I took it and took a nap. Uh huh. So I slept with my baby pumpkin. Well, good. <laughs> I taste? <laughs> I wouldn't do that personally, but... She wouldn't taste it anyway. Yes, she, mine would have. <laughs> yeah, you? yours would have. That's why I would never offer a straw to boomer. You would have it right in your mouth. <laughs> That's why I would never oh. offer a straw to boomer. So, I didn't get to go for a walk today. Because you were up all night last night. Yeah, but... Just chatting away with friends. Yeah. So, so you slept all day. I didn't sleep all day. Come on, now. Well, you I, know I was fighting it. I couldn't sleep. Well, I toiled in the backyard, getting all wet. And you know I didn't sleep all day. <laughs> It was a rough sleeping day. I couldn't sleep. But I'm okay now. I took a nap. Now we're going to watch... What, what What Halloween are we watching? It, it's, it's Rob Zombie's Halloween. So the remake of the first Halloween mm -hmm. by Rob Zombie. Yep. You just licked my finger. You're licking my finger. So we're going <laughs> to settle in for the night. Oh. <laughs> All right. And we're going to watch some Halloween. Happy Halloween. So, if we hope you enjoyed something you liked in our video today. Yes, even if it was just me picking crackles up and bringing them up here on the couch. And look at Angel's face. She looks so sad. She looks so sad. Anyway, we hope you enjoyed a little bit of something that you saw in our video today. If you did, please give us a favorite. Share our video with your family and friends and any strangers you may know. Just say, hey, walk up to them and say, hey, check out the neighbors on YouTube. They're awesome. That's what I would do. And leave us a comment down below. But most of all, please subscribe. And we will see you all tomorrow.